guys is going on my name is Lewis and God bless every single one of you today is July 11 2023 and welcome to the Grand Supreme News channel all right guys so we have some breaking news updates very important information coming out if you can please share the video and it says here coming soon to a convenience store near you facial recognition required for entry to convenience store in portland oregon i want to play this video to you guys but let me show you something else here all right this is happening in phoenix and it's going to happen in multiple states phoenix area whole food stores introduce pay with palm technology all right so everything is moving really fast guys when it comes to technology debit cards and cash will be useless all right let me just play this video here if you can please share this um here we go i'm gonna set up the audio so uh so uh, you guys can listen to it please look at camera for entry damn it you're standing on the shoes i think get the screw if we get the green light that'll open the door for you Oh, stand on the shoes? <laughs> Please look at camera for entry. All right, so it's, it's asking the person to stand on the, uh, I guess, on the ground to have a mat. Uh, you got to put your foot on the mat and you got to look straight up towards the camera, right? So let me show you something really quick here. All right, you see the uh, that top part. It says, uh, "Look at the camera for entry." Right now, it's locked. So when you step on the mat and look at the camera, it's gonna take a picture of your face, and then uh, it's going to pull up whatever is on the database. If this person is a criminal, it's not allowed to come into the store. Uh, if this person has no background record, whatever, uh, the doors will open. So again, uh, right now is red. And she's standing on a mat. You can't see it though, but uh, the person in the background is saying you got to stand on top of the mat. And look up. There we go. You see that part? It turns green. Right, give me a second here, guys. So it turns green. So the, uh, the facial recognition, AI, artificial intelligence, whatever it is, uh, scan her face and uh is saying that this person is good to come in and uh again this is where we are right now guys so um back in 2020 you remember all that defund the uh the p-o-l-i-c-e all that was uh all planned because it's gonna be a replacement for the p-o-l-i-c-e they're gonna be replaced by this type of stuff just like um ai could replace us when it comes to jobs. So um, I will talk more about this one here, guys, but uh, we're gonna talk um, about what's going on in Phoenix because this is also the real deal. So from face uh, facial recognition to uh, pay with palm technology, again, cash and debit card will be useless in the next couple of years. All right, guys, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends, family, so loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, guys, I posted videos today. Those link will be in the comments box. For those of you that want to send us letters to prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Guys, I just posted a video not too long ago. Uh, the links will be in the comments box. Also, I post a video over at my new channel. Once again, make sure you follow me there. Uh, I will be posting a video at least once a day, so I'm not going to be uh you know uh storming a lot of videos or doing tons of videos in that channel it's just gonna be one video day all right so it says here sir you're missing the six 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 ooh no entry 
No entry. Hmm. All right. So we are seeing great stuff, uh, great Bible prophecy happening right in front of our faces. So imagine not needing cash, a card, or your phone to pay. Only your hand. It is called palm recognition technology. And that method of payments is already here at every Whole Food in the Valley. So it started with the food industry. That's what's happening right now is going for the food. Now, again, the Bible says in the book of Revelation, you can no longer buy or sell. The first thing is buy, all right? Um, the first thing is buy. So people want to go in and buy food. We can't take cash. Can't take debit cards. Excuse me, ma'am. Uh, can you just move to the side? I got to take care of this customer. Scan the forehead. Boop. You go. You're good to go. So, uh, again, guys, it's going to be a time that uh, is going to happen. A lot of people is going to be like, well, how are we going to survive? Oh, what are we going to eat? I mean, how are we going to live? When the day comes, the first thing people need to do is pray. What did Jesus said? Don't worry what you're going to eat, what you're going to wear. Jesus also said that uh, look at the sky and see the birds flying. They know where to find food. They know where to uh, find shelter. They know where to find clean water. It's because God lead them to those, uh, again, shelter, food, and water. Jesus also said we are more valuable than those birds than any un uh, animals on earth. These animals find things because, again, it's in their nature. God has, has uh, um, you know, placed them. These animals have an instinct. They know because they were gifted. God has uh, 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 given uh, all this uh, gift. Now, we, we also have, uh, again, we also have all this if people only put their faith and trust in God and Jesus Christ. Problem is, is that people's running towards the world. And they, cho uh, they choose that uh, the things of the world is much more satisfying than, uh, than a book, a Bible. Uh, Lewis, I don't want to look, you know, read the Bible and this and that. You know, I don't see nothing coming out of it. And, uh, you know, I see things right here in front of me. Is that people don't see uh, the reality. It's, it's faith. You got to have faith. You got to put your fa uh, faith and trust in Jesus Christ and good things will come to I mean, in your life so when that day comes when it comes you know the uh, mark of the beast have no fear god will take care of his people god will feed his people god will make sure that his people have shelter he did it before and he will do it again remember jesus fed the five thousand so again, guys, uh, people need to start uh, running towards the kingdom of God because again, this kingdom here that's going on in this world, this kingdom is the kingdom of the devil. All right, this is Satan kingdom right here. Satan is saying, you know, if you want this food right here, if you want this grape, you bow down to me. You take that thing and put it in your hand. Uh, again, you will pledge allegiance to the Antichrist. Right? It ain't gonna happen. It ain't going to happen because this hand right here ain't going to see none of that type of stuff. So, or this forehead. Again, the only thing uh, that we, uh, we will accept is the whole armor of God and putting our faith and trust in Jesus Christ. All right, so imagine not needing cash. So I, I'm going to skip that part. As far as handprint scanning and other biometric like eye scanning is definitely the way of the future. Again, guys, now we have the eye scanning and the facial recognition. We got all that. But when it comes to, you know, again, the, the palm, when it comes to the forehead, when it comes to the neural link, uh, when it comes to all that, now it's a whole different ballgame. But uh, I got a strong feeling that many people will take it. A lot of people will take it. They're going to say, well, it ain't that bad. I believe even Christian 
We'll take it. But here's the thing, guys. Don't get too comfortable with the things of the world. There's a red alert going on right now, and it's so bright, but a lot of people's not seeing it. Guys, the phones is only the beginning. This here is causing massive problem to people's life. It's separating the people from the Holy Spirit, from, from scriptures. What's next? VR, virtual reality? Apple just announced their VR and it's going to go for $3,500. That's not bad. You know, for, you know, $3,500 is, is nothing, you know, <laughs> to rich people. But again, uh, it's a whole new world. I just seen a video that this, this elderly lady, uh, she lost her hus husband. Uh, I think she's like 65, almost 70. She lost her husband, right? And uh, they, they got this new thing that you sit down, you turn on the computer, boom! Her husband popped out. She's like, honey, is that you? He's like, yes, it's me. It's me. And I can't believe I'm talking to you. She's like, I can't believe I'm talking to you too. I miss you so much. Since you passed away, I can't sleep. He's like, honey, I'm here for you. No matter what, I will be here forever and ever. We got to thank the people that created this. I'm like, ah, uh, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's it's getting really bad, guys. It's, it, it, it's just brutal, the stuff that's coming out nowadays. Mm. The palm recognition system is called Amazon One. With biometric, one of the things that great is that your information is tied to you, this person said. Only one set of eyes that matches your identity. Now, same thing with your fingerprints, same thing with palm recognition and facial recognition. So that's a good thing. Customers we spoke with were split. It just makes the transition out of the grocery store a lot faster. Uh, this person said, it is a little bit scary. I love technology, so I decided to check it out. I didn't feel comfortable. It's just grocery shopping. This person said, it's just grocery shopping. That's, that's nothing wrong. You just, you know, just take it. It's just grocery shopping. Mm-hmm. When people start getting hungry, they will do anything. When people start getting hungry, especially the young ones start getting hungry, They would do anything and say, you know what? I don't want my kids to go through hunger. Put it in there. Put it in my palm. I don't want to see my young ones getting hungry. And that's how the Antichrist, the devil, gets you. This is why I tell people that it's very important. And, uh, you know, um, I'm trying to save up to get uh, a homestead. And, um, you know, because it's very important that people start um, planting their own food. Uh, start doing your own thing and it's very important to prep get your stuff ready because eventually all this stuff you know the seeds like plant seeds and strawberry seeds and whatever you know vegetable seeds all that is going to be taken away you need to start having your own garden you need to start getting your own clean water uh, just like in the beginning uh, there was no grocery store there was none of that type of stuff you how to grow your own stuff. But again, nowadays people just, you know, they rely on the G, uh, the, the GOV and uh, just rely on the things we have now. You got to work for yourself. Don't work for the big man. When I say big man, I'm talking about those that, that comes knocking your door saying, hey, it's tax season. All right, so I don't feel comfortable. It's just a grocery shopping, Mr. Martinez said. Why would you scan your finger uh, for eyes or anything to buy grocery? It freaks me out. Andrea Chavez uh, said, I'm not going to say that I'm not going to do it. Maybe sometime for convenience, but it freaks me out. So part of the fear that people may see is that someone may cut off a limb like you see in the movies, in order to pay for stuff, this person said. But 
that isn't going to happen. For the most part, your biometric data is safe. And it's going to make the future of transaction a lot easier to deal with. Now you have uh, Kelso says it is easier to hack your account online that have password. So while uh, paying for items will become a breeze in the future, it could become more difficult to teach our young ones about the value of money. With the uh, automatic payment system, it's really, uh, uh, it is really hard um, to teach the young ones how to value their money, this person said. You already see um, that with credit cards and debit cards, Panera, uh, some airports and stadium across the country uh, have palm reading technology. Even hospital. Even a hospital. I remember it was like two years ago, went to the emergency room. All right, you need to sign up. I'm like, what's a clipboard? You don't need to do that. Put your hand, I mean, your palm in that machine. I'm like, hey. Boop. that's it. Uh, it's basically your fingerprints and, you know, they got all your information in the data. I mean, this is where we at right now. From, uh, you know, old school, like sitting down and just writing your name on a clipboard and that's it. Now everything has completely changed. Everything is all electronic. Welcome to the future. And now we head to Portland. And we're gonna see this in multiple states. Look at Sleeping Giant coming soon to a convenience store near you. Facial recognition required for entry. You seen those videos on TikTok? That you see everybody just going in and just taking stuff and stealing? These companies are not going to allow it and say that's a game over. Hmm. Man, things are changing really quick, guys. If I were you, if you don't know Christ, now is the time to get to know Jesus Christ. Now is the time to get ready. Because there's, there's a lot of changes that's going to happen in this world. And uh, you guys see my videos uh, about the church, about the wars, about the reprobate minds that's going on, the abomination that's going on, the young ones under attack. It's happening guys everything's gonna be uh transformed the sleeping giant that we once knew is dead thank you so much for watching guys once again for those of you that want to give a light to christ you can email me my email is in the description box me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path and that's the path of our lord and savior jesus christ for those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests you can send it to me Luis santiago or my wife jessica santiago at 3432 us highway 19 number two holiday florida 34691 once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get you access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about in the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Give a like to Jesus Christ and get baptized. We are living in tough time. Till next time later. Peace.